good folks here live. Um, I am getting ready to get my hair braided. I had a long, we had a time last night. We had a time. Um, so last night I went out with my meetup group and it was just the bomb. We did like a pre-Juneteenth event and then we um, went out to dinner and it was just really nice to catch up with the gals. Um, I've been out of commission. So um, that's really been really good to like get back in the swing of things. And yeah, so I'm getting my hair done. Box braids, my first time getting box braids in years. I'm actually getting knotless braids. Maybe I shouldn't say box, um, box braids. I don't know if they're the same, whatever. So I'm going to um, Jamaica um, at the end of the month, but I wanted to go ahead and get it because y'all, I'm so tender headed. And um, let me put y'all down. And I'm trying to cook before, I'm trying to eat before I get there so I don't have to worry about food. I know if I eat, I'm good for at least three, four hours. Um, so, you have to see about that. So I'm trying to multitask um, with everything I got going on here. Welcome back to the channel. Um, I am on my way, well, about to go get my braids. Y'all, I'm getting braids. I haven't had braids, like box braids, knotless braids in years. And when I say years, I mean like 10 plus years. Um, I'm getting ready to go out um, on vacation at the end of the month. And I just didn't wanna like mess with my hair. So yesterday, um, I have a natural hairstylist, so I went to her and she washed my hair, deep conditioned it, um, did a treatment on it before I actually get the braids, so that's why y'all see this little poof. Um, but I had to blow dry it because last night I went out, I went to a Juneteenth um, weekend thing with my meetup group and it was so great, um, y'all. I'll put some clips in here for you guys to watch. It's very beautiful because I'm glad that I can be the conduit for that. Absolutely. We need those spaces more than ever than not to be continuously defined via nature and continuous, right? There's so many different walks of life and um it was so dope. And then we went out to eat and so girl. We had a time last night. You hear me? We had a time. Okay, great to catch up with the girls. So yeah, I'm, I think she's like 25 minutes away from me. So I'm cooking breakfast because I just don't want to deal with being hungry at somebody's house and I know I'm really picky. Um, so I'm grabbing some food. I'm gonna bring some water, take some medicine because I'm tender headed y'all, I don't know. Shout out to all the tender-headed people out there. Uh, I'm just trying to prepare myself mentally for these braids um, and pray that it doesn't take all day. Um, yeah, I am about to go, so. Y'all, I got my braids in. Okay, sis did exactly what she needed to do. Sis did what she had to do. Now I'm ready for my vacation. Vacate. All right, y'all, so I just got back from the hair store to get some stuff for my hair. Okay, I wanted to show y'all what I'm using here. Let me take my sunglasses off. Okay, so these is what I picked up. So I got a bonnet here. I don't know why I got this color. Is it silk? Yeah, it is a silk bonnet for my braids. 
a long silk bonnet. I don't know why I got this color. But. And then I got some mousse here. And then I've been hearing about this oil here. So I purchased some of this. This is the Mayel Rosemary uh, Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthener Oil. I'm gonna use this on my edges and like in the middle of my part. I'm actually about to use some now. Um, yeah, so I heard about this. And then this is the Mayel um, Edge Gel. I've heard about this too, so I wanted to try this. And then I have a cap here. I'm a rough sleeper. What color did I get? Y'all, I got, I didn't even show, see the color, but whatever. I'm gonna put this all over my head so it, my parts will stay crisp. So, yes, I'm tired. I'm about to lay down, I'm about to rest. We're going to a cookout later on today. So, I will check back in with you guys. Look at my hair. Like, who are you? Y'all, yeah, I'm feeling myself. So, I thought I would end the vlog, but I'm not. I think that I am going to try to make my videos longer here. And I know the lighting sucks, y'all. Um, I'm on my way to Roses. Shout out to everyone that's in a town and they have roses and driving distance because roses is the clutch. Okay, they have cute clothes. Um, I'm gonna take y'all around today. So I'm going to roses. I actually need some cleaning supplies. So I'll show y'all the cleaning supplies that I'll be telling y'all about. I'm gonna show, I'm gonna see if they have some cute outfits because honey, your girl wears them all. And if it's a sale, I'm gonna get it okay I'm gonna look fly in my roses outfit so I'm on my way there and then I'm going grocery shopping I'm going to Trader Joe's Publix and where else am I going um, I think that's it um, <clears throat> I may stop to Target I've been looking for the little travel size um, Lysol spray Sometimes I know I've I purchased them from Target, but sometimes they do not have them. So I'm on the hunt for them because again, y'all know I'm going on my trip um within like seven days. Like I want to Jamaica in seven days. Yeah, so we're trying to decide if we are going to check a bag or if because normally when we travel, no matter how many I we went to Aruba for like eight days and we only carried um, we only did like carry-ons. I don't really like checking bags because it's just a lot of tussle. You gotta wait for the bags to come. It's just a lot. So we normally just pack two carry-on bags whenever we travel and we try to get as much of stuff as possible in those bags. But this trip, I think we're gonna check a bag because we're going snorkeling and we have our own snorkeling gear. So that is the only know because I think I personally think that I can fit everything in the carry-on bag but my uh, Marcus is like I don't know I think we should um, I think we should check a bag so we might just end up checking a bag um, so we'll see how that go oh I just don't like and I feel like the airport that we fly out of it's like a hit or miss like we never know when they're busy and we have like a super early flight. Ugh, it's just a lot of things. Like when we just get to the airport, we normally just go to the gate. You know what I mean? Um, go to the gate and then our plane be almost boarding. Like, but with a check bag, you gotta go to the kiosk, get your stuff printed, make sure it weighs a certain amount. It's just a lot of logistics behind checking a bag. So, we'll see y'all. We'll okay y'all. Yeah, that's I, that's what you're going to see in the next couple of shots. Me shopping at Ross. I mean, not Ross. Roses. And, um, 
you know what I really need? I really need a city train. Okay, city train be having cute stuff too. My niece has me on the Shein app, and I think that they're a hit or miss. I do have a Shein haul coming out. I don't know when it's gonna come out. Um, my package is supposed to come next week, so um, I'm waiting on another package from them, and then I'll probably do a whole haul. Um, but my niece has me on the Shein um, website. I, I think it's a hit or miss. Some of the quality is okay, and some of the quality is like terrible. Um, I don't know. I. It, the site is iffy to me. I don't know. I, I guess I, I like I like things on a budget, but I also love for my material to, you know, be something of substance. Like, I don't want to just buy something because it's cheap. I want to buy it because it's it's quality. Um, and so that is where I'm at with that. But I'm not gonna take your head off. Stay tuned um, for this roses store tour. All right, guys, so we're at the roses. We're at the roses. They are three, four ninety nine. These are cute. I don't think the shoes look cheap. That's, that's the only thing about roses. They, they shoes look like a little cheap. Y'all see how cheap this is? You can't even get this at the dollar store. The this is like seven dollars in Walmart. So if you're sleeping on your roses, then I don't know what to tell you. But what am I, what am I getting? I do need some of these. All right, so I just finished um, going to roses, and y'all, I forgot that there was a city train over here, so I'm on my way to the city train to see what they got. So stay tuned. Just got back. 
just got paid. Feeling right. Just okay. These cucumbers are huge, right? Oh, this is a wrap that I got you, Mark. This is a chicken wrap that we're going to have for lunch here. Oh, Marcus loves these. They good, y'all. Yeah. Got some cheese Y'all should on it. definitely try that. I got some garlic bread. Marcus, I got the garlic bread. Oh, okay. Is it bread bread? Uh, bread these bread. are Brussels sprouts, y'all. These are the bomb.com. And then we got our shrimpages. And then we got our granola bars. We got our broccoli. One pound for the broccoli. One pound for the broccoli. And then we got our turkey bacon. We love this brand of turkey bacon. We have two here. And then my little pleasure pee. Uh, pusher pee. <laughs> pusher pee. Have this. Okay, that's all what we have. And that was uh, $10,000. <laughs> The so, spending, the spending <laughs> spirit is on her. I'm, I, and I'm gonna um, show y'all what I got from Roses. Um, I did go to Audi, and I got all this stuff from Audi, but it's so much. <clears throat> um, but I will say this: these right here are the bomb. Am I saying it? Right? A word? <laughs> these, <laughs> these right here. Y'all, these right here are really good here. Um, they have actual real strawberries in them. So, these are really good. So, if you're at Audi, definitely get two, three of these. Um, Is trail mix? Yes, I got trail mix. I have three of them. I got mostly what I got from Audi is fruit. We love these sweet potato chips. It's really good. I got some pickles. I have some ranch dressing. This is like the only ranch dressing that I eat. I do not like Hidden Valley. Love this. So I got this skirt. I thought this was cute. I might, I'm gonna dress it up here. And this was only $8.99 here. It's a long skirt. Let me put this over here. This is $2.50. If you go to Walmart or Target, you're at least gonna pay $3.50 for this. So this was $2.50. I showed you how much this was in the video. Kaboom! Boom! Then I got my pine saw. I got this bucket too, y'all. This bucket was only a dollar. This mop bucket. Oh, I got the Fabulosa. Fabulosa. And then I have some dishwasher cleaner stuff. And then some air freshener. Um, I'm actually gonna put this in my car. Marcus, you gotta eat it like that. Like that wasn't a, that wasn't a smart. Why would you do that? <laughs> and guys, this is here i'm about to go work out but i hope that you guys enjoyed everything about this vlog it is longer than my normal vlog so y'all let me know if y'all feeling the longer vlogs um yeah so don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to tell your mama to tell day mama ain't that right marcus tell day mama to subscribe to the channel like, comment, subscribe. One, two, three. Boom. There you go. 